Wim van Doren. I'm working at a small company of Grassa in the Netherlands. And we are working on a biorefinery, Greenleaf's biorefinery here in, um, in Uganda in the framework of the Bio for Africa project. Basically, uh, biorefinery um, means in our case that we uh, take uh, fresh uh, green leaves of plants, uh, various types of plants. And in the green leaves, it's the primary place where uh, proteins are being built in, uh, in a plant. So what we do, uh, we take these, uh, these leaves, we uh, squeeze them, press them, and we get a press cake and we get a, a juice. And from the juice, we can uh, make a protein concentrate. A protein concentrate can replace uh, uh, soy, uh, so there is less need for importing uh, soy. Um, and the protein concentrate can then be dried and used for, uh, for animal feed, like for chicken and, uh, and pigs. Um, and the press cake, it's the fibrous part of the, of the leaves. Um, you can uh, uh, ensile it and you can feed it to the cows and the goats. And um, for them it's a nutritious uh, uh, feed. And more important is that it can be uh, kept for long time periods. It can be easily transported. And um, so um, we have uh, multiple products from the green leaves. And that uh, is a, a opportunity for the farmers to gain more income. We uh, were already uh, working with uh, KRC, with KRC, uh, Cabarolo Research uh, Center in um, in Uganda, Western Uganda, and uh, yeah, in the Bio for Africa project, we continue working with them, uh, and we uh, we build up uh, uh, a small scale bio refinery. And um, yeah, and try to make it operational and really be uh, a sustainable uh, production unit that also can uh, keep on running after the project because it's sustainable and it is profitable.